Okay, hi. Um, I just started making this video like three times and my computer wasn't starting up. Anyways, um, I don't have a central message to talk about really or like, yeah. But I wanted to make a video basically on the same thing I always make videos on, which is learning how to love yourself and enjoy who you are as a person. Um, so... I think that being yourself is a really, really difficult thing to do because you have people always telling you to dress a certain way, to wear this kind of makeup or to straighten your hair, to curl your hair, or you have to wear heels all the time, or you have to lie to impress the opposite sex or the same sex for relationships, or wear all this makeup and like just all these different things that are just pushed at you. You have to like weigh this much and you have to be unbelievably tall and skinny and you know just these things that we all try to do. We lie and say we're happy when we're not or we hide our scars and we hide who we are and all of our imperfections because we think that they don't make us important or they make us not as cool as everybody else and we're always striving to be better. We want to be prettier, smarter, funnier richer, whatever, we're always striving to be something different than we are. And I think it is perfectly acceptable and perfectly okay, and I encourage you trying to better yourself by learning more, by pushing yourself out of your comfort zone, and going to school and getting an education, or following your dreams and passions. I completely encourage that. What I don't encourage is you pretending to be something you're not, because... I think by being who you are, you're putting something in the world that wasn't there before. Like, every single individual is made the way they are for a reason. You have your certain tics and things that make you happy and the things that you're passionate about. Those are part of you for a reason and they make you different. There's not a single other person on the planet who's going to be just like you. Someone can spend their whole life striving and trying to be like you. And they can never be exactly you. And I think by being yourself in this world that's telling you all these different things, it's a really great accomplishment because that doesn't happen often because we try so hard to please everybody and we think that who we are is a burden or it's not enough or we have to try and be something different and you don't have to because by being you, you're putting something here that wasn't here and you're adding something to this world and it's something beautiful and something to be proud of. Um, I know... That sometimes a lot of you with your past, you don't want to share it with people, which is completely understandable because we don't like showing the imperfections, but imperfections are what make you beautiful and that's what people are going to fall in love with. They're going to fall in love with the way your eyes light up when you talk about your favorite things or you can be comfortable around them and what's beautiful is always going to be what is in your soul. It is not going to be what you look like. And I know, depending on who you surround yourself with, that may not be the case because people do judge based off of appearances. I think everybody does. But I want you to see that what's really beautiful in you is what's in your soul and that's something that you should be proud of and you should cherish it and you should let everybody know exactly who you are because that is a gift. To be who you are is an incredible gift and it's something that you deserve to show the world because everybody deserves to see how wonderful you are and how bright you are and smart you are and how funny you are and beautiful. And you are a completely unique individual. And I know that sometimes we could try and, there's a bug, we try and fit into these little like groups. Like we want to be popular, or we want to be the pretty girl or the smart girl or whatever it is. We try and fit into these little groups and these categories. And you don't have to because you're born to stand out. You're born able to make whatever decisions you want to make and be whoever you want to be and you just you should embrace that fully because it's just something so beautiful and I think people don't realize that people don't realize that they're made who they are for a reason and you're allowed to be proud of your imperfections because that's the beauty nothing perfect is get, there's nothing perfect anything you can find imperfections and if you look hard enough 
But I just, I think those are the things that we need to embrace because people are going to love them. Maybe it's hard to find it, but there are going to be people who love those little things about you that maybe you don't particularly like about yourself. But you deserve to live a life being who you are. You don't need to lie. You don't have to pretend to be something different. You deserve a life in which you get to be exactly who you are and embrace it and feel free because you're not pretending. Who you are is awesome. Who you are is legendary. And just by being you, you make the biggest difference in the world. You're changing things just by being yourself. And I just, I think that's a really incredible thing. And I encourage you guys to embrace every little aspect of who you are and to be proud of it. Because I really, I really, truly believe that who you are is a gift and you should let the whole world see it.